Putting waste into a financially viable product is a practice that has proven to improve economies. For instance, the waste industry in the United Kingdom employs about 95,000 persons and generates about 9.5 billion pounds annually. Now that Nigeria is seeking ways to diversify the economy, experts say waste management and recycling is a sure alternative for wealth generation. There's an opportunity here, an opportunity that the government should look at closely, an opportunity that private sector should be excited. 9.5 billion is not a small money. Now, you know, the, even the bigger thing is, 9.5 billion in Nigeria is it, actually a dwarf because Nigeria has 170 million people. And Nigeria currently is a disposable and a consumer oriented economy. So, 9.5 billion could actually be 20 billion easily. Ensuring that the nation continues to benefit from its investment, asset managers say already existing infrastructure must be sustained. Assets to waste, waste to wealth, but most importantly, a sustainable future. Looking at the services for now, taking care of the people now, but remembering the future. What we canvass for is to get people to know that waste should as much as possible be minimized. Let's try to reduce or use our assets in such a way that waste is minimal. And then even when we can't afford to, you know, reduce it, let's try to reuse. If we can't reuse, let's try to recycle. To champion the cause to mainstream recycling and asset management in the nation's commercial activities, waste managers have organized a summit to enlighten individuals and corporate bodies on the benefits of reducing, reusing or recycling waste. From Abuja, Chika Onyesi, STV News.